the mountain and did it over the place. My name is Camila Mumuya, formerly Camila Miller. I was in 1994 to 1995, started to do Rodriguez I'm currently an IT sales professional at a Fortune 100 company, a wife, and a mother of five. First off, I want to say thank you to the Hermes family, Mint, Frodo, and Mayo's families for hosting me while I was in Tartu. They were amazing hosts and made me feel welcome and at home at all times. So I just want to show you a few of the pictures from my host family. These were inside my host family home. I come from a large family in the United States. So it was nice being part of family events such as this one that you see on the screen here and all kind of other events throughout the year with my Rotary family. One of the nice things about being an exchange student is that I got a chance to travel. Around Tartu, I actually got a chance to take some classes at the university at Tartu Uliko. I also got a chance to go on the senior class trip with my secondary school. I went to Sur Munamagi just on an independent trip and also did some traveling with my host family and with the Rotary Club on Rotary Club trips. For example, I got a chance to go to the Thailand Rotary Club, and I also get, went to Finland, to Helsinki, and then I got to see the real Santa Claus in Rovaniemi, Finland. Um, I also get a chance with one of my host families to go to Riga, Latvia. So these are pictures from my Puha Yarve senior class trip that I took with the high school. It was amazing, and of course we did a, um, we actually, they have a tradition of every year doing a fake marriage, and it was great. We made food. We did the sauna. We had a great time on this trip. Here's a picture that I took from the top of Sur Muramagi on one of my trips. And then here's also another picture of my host family in Parnu. Uh, my second host family and I, we got a chance to take a trip there and it was beautiful. Island was one of the highlights of the trip. We got a chance to explore downtown, old town, and different parts of Tallinn with the Rotary Club First family. It was a very great experience for me. While I was in Estonia, I was gifted several of this Estonian brooch. Um, I was told that it was supposed to be kind of for fertility and then also for protection and good luck between the um, childbearing age all the way up to retirement, grandmother <laughs> age. Um, well, it's been a good luck charm for me. Obviously, I've, we actually have five kids between my husband and I. We, um, we've we actually had five kids together. So I can say that maybe I learned a lot while I was in Estonia. First of all, I learned a lot about culture. I learned about sauna. I learned about the importance of choirs, the summer singing festival. For foods, I actually tried very worse, which is very different from any food I'd ever had before. <laughs> um, for Christmas, I learned about Yoluvana. Springtime, I learned about Easter traditions, um, you know, all about the sports and skiing events in Estonia. And overall, I just learned a lot about the culture and how beautiful it is. Um, freezing cold, but very, very beautiful culture. The other thing I learned is that I really love to travel. Since I went to Estonia, it really opened my eyes about how great it is to travel and to learn more about other countries. Um, so I've also been since Estonia. Estonia was my first place outside of the United States. But since I've been to Russia, Tanzania, Mexico, Brazil, and a few places outside of the U.S., so um, really encouraged me to continue to travel and foster that love of travel, international travel. Um, lastly, I learned, and this is probably the most important thing, is that while cultures are different all around the world, people are very, very similar around the world. So I just want to say thank you so much. Congratulations on the 85th year of the Rotary Club in Tartu. And I want to say have a great night, have fun, had ud.